Good evening. Some disturbing accusations tonight against a Laurel County man. Police say that he injured a cat by throwing it into a fire not just once, but twice. They've charged George Leith with animal torture for an incident police say happened last year. Today, he talked to us from the Laurel County Detention Center, and he claims police arrested the wrong person. Bill Pendleton has our top story at 6. People who live on Waterworks Road in London tell me they do remember the incident, but the man accused in the crime claims from jail that it wasn't him who did it. Trying to get back at me or something, I don't, I don't understand it. George Leith says he's being blamed now for something that happened a year ago near his ex-girlfriend's home. He says a teenager is the one responsible. He was the one who threw the cat in the fire, but... Uh, I guess to get out of trouble, it got blamed on me. Six teenagers were charged with numerous arsons in that part of Laurel County last year. The warrant states that on May 31st, Leith picked up the affiant's cat and threw it in the fire. The cat got out, but he allegedly threw it in again. I hope this can get straightened out. You know? I don't want to spend time in here for. Something, something like crazy to Peggy. I mean, I didn't even do it. We don't know exactly what happened to the cat, but Leith tells me that he believes it did survive. Leith is charged with torture of a dog or a cat. He was arrested on a warrant signed by one of the alleged victims of this case. Police tell me that because of that, they do not have any information on the arrest. In Laurel County, Phil Pendleton, WKYT. Leith also told us he had never been arrested until now, but a check of jail records showed recent charges of domestic violence and assault.